Welcome back to another edition of Talking About Golf. I'm Buddy Sash, your host professional here at the Ocean City Golf Club. And we're continuing our process of getting better, of playing our best golf this year, this season, right now. So I've talked a little bit about drive and iron shots, but let's face it, we all hit the ball a little crooked. And when I was younger and played a little better, I was a good bunker player, somebody that felt very comfortable hitting it into a bunker. But being lazy over the years, I'm not as good as I used to be. I sort of took it for granted. So one of my efforts this year is to become a great bunker player. Why? So I don't fear them. You always hear the golf pros on TV and on the tour say, I don't, I'm not afraid of the bunker, I'm trying to make it. Well, let's make our goal one that says we're going to be the same way. There's no reason. I don't have to be big and strong. I just have to take some time. So what I found is that I was squaring up too much and digging too much sand. So this year, I'm going to work on my game, and I want to talk about a couple of things. I use the V method. I'm going to line my body to the left of the target with the club face wide open. Then I'm going to pick it up, swing it down, and sort of push the ball or flop the ball out to the right just a little bit. So I set up, ball's off my left heel, club face wide open to use the natural bounce of the club, and then I'm going to splash the sand and make a nice bunker shot. I'm going to get more up and down this year, and I'm going to cut two shots off my score just for the work that I'm going to put in the bunkers so that I don't fear them, whether it's a par five, par three, or a par four. We'll see you next time on Talking About Golf.